cooking made easy with pumpkin. That's that time of year. So happy with guests today. I have Dr. Josh Bieberdorf and Brenda Bieberdorf of Mountain View Chiropractic. We're going to make a fun recipe, some pumpkin bites, I understand. Yes, pumpkin protein bites. Pumpkin protein bites, and I think they, they look easy, they look delicious. You were going to bring some, but your family loves them so much they ate them all. I did. I made some <laughs> examples to bring to show you, but my kids ate them all. So oh, we'll just That's make them so you can see them today. All right. So it looks like a nice, easy recipe with some pretty good ingredients. What do we do? Absolutely, yeah. So Eric's going to post all this for you, but we're mm. going to just take some oatmeal. Okay. Put in some oatmeal. Then we're going to add some vanilla protein powder. Okay. You can really use any kind of protein powder. I use a, a vegan based one because I don't do too well with dairy, but okay. you can use a whey based as, if you want. Okay. And then we're also going to do some pumpkin. Use your pumpkin. Very nice. And also, I know, Eric, you like to talk about the difference of pumpkin and the pumpkin pie oh, filling. Oh, yes, yes. Do not get the pumpkin pie filling because it's full of sugar and all that other stuff. It would, and it's not good. <laughs> yeah, so this is pure pumpkin, just yeah. pumpkin, no pumpkin pie filling. Yeah. Then we're going to do some almond butter. And these ingredients, you know, people say, well, vanilla, protein powder, almond butter, that's actually easy to find these ingredients. Absolutely. You can find all these ingredients at any store in, in Rapid City. All very easy to find. If you don't like almond butter, you could use peanut butter okay. or sun butter, any of those kind of butters. Okay. And then... And that's, that's something we always talk about, too, just making sure all the ingredients are locally sourced so you can exactly. buy it safely, so easy to get. Yeah, exactly. We're going to add some pumpkin pie spice oh, seasoning, yeah. of course. It is pumpkin, after all. Yes. And then for our sweetener, we're going to do some honey. Mm. Much gotta, better than refined sugar. Absolutely. Yeah. So you can use um, pure honey like this, or you could use maple syrup too, whichever you prefer. Mm -hmm. This is a local sourced honey. We love getting local honey. Yeah. And we're also going to add a little bit of some chocolate chips oh, at the end here <laughs> to make it even a little more kid friendly. So do you want to mix a few of those in, okay. Dr. Josh? And like with any good recipe, I feel like at the end of this, you're going to just have to get your hands dirty. Of course, bit. of course. <laughs> that makes it all the fun. Right? Yeah. So get your kids involved and help you with it. Get your kids involved. You're yeah. going to mix it up. It's really kind of sticky. Get everything mixed up good. And then we're going to just take a cookie scoop. Okay. You want to just take a scoop of that there, Dr. Josh? Oh, okay. And put it in your hand, and you're just going to roll it up. Oh, for heaven's sakes. As easy as that. Easy as pie. Yep, just like that. My hands are very sticky right now. <laughs> and you're going to roll out all of these in the little balls, but then uh, they're going to actually be frozen. Yep. And these have been nicely chilled, and these pumpkin bites are ready to go. Let's try them. Yeah. All right. Mm. That is really good. Okay. Love it. I love the chocolate chips. That's mm -hmm. probably my favorite part. <laughs> mm. Really, really good. Tastes like fall. There you go. Tastes like fall. Mm -hmm. Healthy snack. Oh, I think you love that. Yeah, I think they're great for kids and adults. So, mm -hmm. great way to get some protein in and get that pumpkin in for the fall. Well, like your family, like your family did. I'll just eat them all right now. <laughs> <laughs> really, really good. Thank you for this recipe. It's outstanding. It'll be on the website a bit later on. Thanks, Eric. We'll be right back.